Hey y'all, Phyllis here, SouthernFrugal.com. Uh, I wanted to ask y'all a question because I think that maybe somebody watching will know the answer. Uh, we have been looking for the uh, fuel water separator drain. Now I found it in the book and uh, Mr. Bucky and I talked about it and he, he, he couldn't tell if that was it because neither one of us know anything about motors and I was kind of embarrassed to call the Tiffin people again. I've called them right much. So uh, what I want to do is show you a picture of this in the book up close and then uh, I'm going to take you all outside and try to get as close as I can to what we think is that little uh, water separator thing. Now uh, someone wrote in oh, a couple of months ago and said that, that fuel now you didn't really need to drain that because the diesel was all good I guess. And uh, But anyway I uh, happened to find this the other day. I was looking for something, I think a bucket or something that we had taken with us when we went on our trip and I happened to open that compartment and I said, well, gee, that looks like that drain thing that they were talking about in the instruction book. And uh, so Mr. Bucky hadn't looked at it yet. He's on his walk now. And uh, But anyway, I'm going to do uh, take the camera out there and see if I can get up real close to it. And uh, maybe some of y'all, maybe your husband or somebody you know, know something about diesel engines because when I looked at that thing, I mean, it looks like it has water in it to me and some kind of debris, little sticks or something. I don't know what's in there. But anyway, I'm going to take the camera out there and show you close up. And if y'all know somebody that knows something, uh, have them send me a comment or an email or something and tell me. And because I think that we're going to maybe on Monday see if we can't, you know, unscrew that thing and let that water out. Anyway, so let me show you all the picture. I hope it'll show up. So hold on. Okay. You see this? Let's see it so I can see it right here. There it is on number 11. It says fuel water separator. My camera's kind of making a shadow on it. Fuel water separator drain number 11. And then if you go up to the picture, there's number 11. And there it is right there. Y'all see it? That little thing. And then it's got a little thing on the bottom of it that looks like it unscrews to me. Anyway, so we're going to go out there. Y'all see the motor? I mean, that means nothing to me. But I do think what I'm seeing is that little thing right there. And the instruction book says that you should uh, empty that like every time you fill up with uh, diesel and you know after you filled up and wait a while and then you should unscrew that and let it drain out so anyway I'm gonna take y'all out there and uh, show the thing to you and I hope some of y'all know what we'll be looking at alright we'll be right back okay y'all here's what I was talking about See that thing right there? I mean, I guess that's like a fuel filter. I don't know. There's the little area I was talking about. Let me see if I can get under here. Right there. See it? And you can actually see, I don't know if that's fuel in there or water or what, but I can see debris down in there. Sorry about all this. I'm trying to get to it. So is that fuel or water? You see, you can see debris down in the bottom of it. And there, that little thing looks like it unscrews there at the bottom. And I think that's it. Huh? Anyway, maybe y'all can help us so we know, so we don't have to call Tiffin again. But it looks pretty uh, much like a some kind of filter to me, and I'm just thinking that that's the fuel filter. That's what I'm thinking. Anyway, Mr. Bucky thinks that's what it is too, but he doesn't know for sure. Okay, y'all, so we will see y'all next time. And, uh, sorry, we're out here with the whole the wind. Anyway, if y'all, uh, let me get out of the sun here. 
Well, I can't find there. There. Okay. And now I got my light on. Cut that off. Okay, now. So anyway, there it is. It's that last compartment. Right there. And uh, I mean that's just got to be it. How could it be anything else? I don't know how good y'all could see with the sun coming in so bright like that. But one more look. There it is. That's got to be it because you could, it's like a little vinyl type handle cap. And I think you just unscrew it and let the water out, I think. I don't know. Anyway, y'all let me know what you think. And uh, there's the RV. Yep. There it is in all its brightness and glory. You know, water's coming out of that top thing because I ran the engine for, they said, run it about five minutes once every seven days. And so today was the seventh day. So anyway, I'm going to close that uh, bin there at the motor. Mr. Bucky and I have been doing work in the yard. Can you all see all those limbs and bags down there? Yeah, we've been working pretty hard. All right, y'all. Uh, we'll see y'all next time. Y'all let me know uh, what you think. I mean, we just don't know anything about diesel motors. I might even know more than Mr. Bucky knows at this point. I don't know. Anyway, I wanted to show you real quick my neighbor's azaleas. They're really pretty. They're, they've just passed being in full bloom. Can y'all see the azaleas? And the neighbor across the street over there. And look at those right there past. Does that show up? They're really beautiful. Pink. Right under there past that tree. I don't know if they show up or not. Anyway, there they are across the way at that plantation home over there. They've got some beautiful azaleas too. These right over here are not really in complete full bloom yet. And that dogwood bloomed a little bit, and then it put out all its leaves. But there's a dogwood over there that's just mostly blooms. I guess that's a female tree. Anyway, uh, we will see y'all next time. And uh, if y'all know anything about diesel motors, and if you know that that is, in fact, the uh, diesel filter thing that you let the water out of, or is what we're looking at actual diesel fuel? We just don't know. Mr. Bucky's looking at me like I'm crazy. <laughs> He's out there in the backyard. He doesn't know I'm doing this video. But it was time to ask somebody. All right, we'll see y'all next time. Bye.